I did. I, I, I met him. I, um, I, it was a pleasure to meet him yesterday. Nah, he's great. He's a great, he was very successful. He was a great congressman. And then when you lead by 35 points, it's hard to get people out of there. But I tried very hard for two years and we got him. He's, and he's done, a, he's done a fantastic job. I just wanted to thank you for everything. He told me you've been great. And, you know, look, this country is counting on it. I won Georgia, I know that, by a lot. And the people know it. And, uh, you know, something happened there. I mean, something bad happened. And I hope you join that, uh, that stop because if you, uh, you know, I hope you're going back two years as opposed to just checking, you know, one against the other because that would just be sort of a, a, uh, a signature check that didn't mean anything. But if you go back two years and if you can get to Fulton, you're going to find things that are going to be unbelievable, the, the dishonesty that, we're, that we've heard from them. Right. You know, just good sources, really right. good sources. But Fulton, Fulton is the mother load, you know, as the expression goes, Fulton County. Right. And, uh, well, Mr. President, I want to see, you know, right. Uh, I, you know, I, I, I appreciate your comments, and, and I, I, I can assure you that our team and the GBI that we're only interested right. in, in in the truth and and finding you that's know great. finding the information that's based on the facts and you know yeah. we, we we've been working um, 12 16 hour days and great. you know we're, we're working through it and um, so I can assure you that and um, I, I do appreciate you calling. I know that you're a very, very busy, very important uh, man, and and I'm very honored that that you called. And you know, and quite what you're doing. quite um, quite frankly, I, I, I'm shocked and that, that you you would take time to, to do that. But yeah. I am very appreciative. Now Mark asked me to do it. He, he thinks you're great, and you know, just you have the most important job in the country right now because. If we win Georgia, first of all, if we win, you're going to have two wins. You're not, they're not going to win right now. You know, they're down. Because the people of Georgia are so angry at what happened to me. They know. I won Georgia by a lot. Something bad happened. You have the most important job in the country right now. If we win, you're going to have two more wins. Because otherwise, right now, they're not going to win. Because people in Georgia are so angry at what happened to me. In the call, weirdly... Um, President Trump also uh, references uh, the, Democrat the previous Democratic Party leader uh, in, in Georgia, Stacey Abrams. It, I mean, it's, why he brings Stacey Abrams up in this context, we don't know. Trump clearly seems to be asking this investigator, uh, Francis Watson, whose number he was provided by his chief of staff, Mark Meadows, to investigate fraud in Cobb County and also in Fulton County. Uh, Trump references Stacey Abrams here without saying why he's talking about her, just sort of floating her name as a boogeyman uh, to let this state investigator know what exactly he thinks is wrong with the Georgia vote and what he wants her to find. You know, they dropped ballots. They dropped all these ballots. Uh, Stacey Abrams, really, really terrible. I mean, just a terrible thing. And I will say this, if and when, hope, I mean, hopefully this will show, because if you go back two years or four years, you're going to see it's a totally different signature. But, but hopefully, uh, you know, I will, when, when the right answer comes out, you'll be praised. I mean, I don't know why, you know, they, they made it so hard. They, they will be praised. People will say, great, because that's what it's about, that ability to check and to, and to make it right. Because everyone knows it's wrong. There's just no way. You know, they had people in Georgia, for instance, that won, and I was way ahead of them, and they won because of me. You know, I pulled them, they call it coattails, right? And we pulled them across, and they say, there's no way that I beat you by 15 points. You know, I've had that in uh, We've had plenty of those calls, too. So anyway, but whatever you can do, Francis, it would be, uh, it's a great thing. It's an important thing for the country. So important. You have no idea it's so important. Whatever you can do, it's important. You have no idea how important. When the right answer comes out, you will be praised. You will be praised. Uh, the Georgia state prosecutor in uh, Fulton County, Fonnie Willis, launched a criminal investigation into President Trump last month. Um, he is being investigated for having pressured Georgia election officials to pervert the results of the election to declare him the winner. 
Uh, in addition to Trump, the investigation is also reportedly looking into efforts to try to overturn the election by South Carolina Senator Lindsey Graham and by the president's lawyer, Rudy Giuliani. It now seems a possibility we can add one more name to the list. Mark Meadows, former White House chief of staff, because she was name-checked and for lots of other reasons. We will be joined.